Hi, I'm Gary Koppelman, a fifth grade science teacher at Blissfield Elementary School in a small rural farming community of Blissfield, Michigan. I'm the 2013 Shell National Science Teaching Award winner, the second person as an elementary teacher to do so. I am overwhelmed with excitement and encouragement to continue to touch the children's interest in science after receiving this prestigious award. My goal in talking with you in this short video is to encourage you in your passion to teach science and to consider to applying for this award. Are you excited about touching the learning palette of a child? Do you get excited and have fun with students on a daily basis? Do you spend more than the required amount of time at school doing lesson plans, preparing for the next day, thinking of how to reach the student that doesn't quite understand and then wake up during the middle of the night to an idea that has just flooded your dream world? Do you consider yourself a lifelong learner and know you haven't arrived at what you are to learn? Do you have ideas to teach science concepts? And as you use those ideas in your classroom to inspire students, the light starts to flash in the students' eyes and, and you get excited. If you said yes to any of these questions, or have found yourself in one of the situations mentioned, you qualify to begin the process to be recognized as the 2014 Shell National Science Teaching Award winner. How do I know? I found myself last fall saying yes to these questions. I thought it was an impossible task and almost didn't apply because I didn't consider my teaching that outstanding how wrong that thinking was. The Shell Oil Company has partnered with the National Science Teachers Association to honor dedicated teachers and their passion to teach science. This esteemed award recognizes an outstanding classroom teacher, grades kindergarten through 12th grade, which has had a positive impact on his or her students, their school, and the community through exceptional science teaching. If you have science lessons or a science curriculum that causes students to develop their desire to search for answers for life and go on to explore various areas of science, you are a candidate to be considered. If you have seen gains in your school's science test scores or in your students' interest in science, you need to consider applying. If you have been a part of making and developing your community involvement with your school, especially in the area of science, the award is waiting for you to claim. If you have asked your students to try new things and step outside their box to grow in their educational growth, this award application process will cause you to grow professionally and you will set the example for your students to obtain the impossible. I want to walk you through that process from the position of knowing where you are considering this award to the gala to recognize your exceptional teaching skills. The first step for candidates will be to fill out the application and follow the required components provided at the NSTA awards website. This part of the process will cause you to review your teaching career and teaching philosophy. A one-page resume that gives details of your teaching experience, professional activities, formal education, awards and publication, community involvement is the first requirement. A one-week schedule of your teaching responsibilities will need to be provided. The schedule should include times and your subjects or classes taught. You are asked to briefly describe the content or thematic course of the classes. The students' demographics of the school will be part of this section as well. You would submit one page describing your teaching philosophy. This is your opportunity to express your heart in what you believe that makes a difference in science education within your classroom. Next, you have the opportunity to communicate how you carry out your philosophy in the instructional methods section. You have five page limit that will describe your classroom activities that represent the nature of science, how you increase student knowledge and skills while enhancing activities of science, making it exciting and relevant. How you make connections with science, the student's world, and the community needs to be expressed. Of course, how you encourage the scientific inquiry and problem solving will need to be included as well in this part of the application. Part of the application will be your four letters of support. One will come from someone who nominates you for the award. The other three letters will come from administration, teaching colleagues, parents, or former students you have influenced. 
you should select individuals who know you and can express various aspects of your teaching passion. Letters should be signed and dated on letterheads when possible. The letters will complete your application that needs to be submitted by the middle of November. The applications that are complete and follow the requirements will be judged by a panel of nine judges from across the United States. From the numerous applications, 10 finalists will be selected. What an honor to be considered in the top 10. Teachers from elementary, middle, and high schools are selected. These 10 are asked to prepare a 30-minute video showing their science teaching in their science classroom element. You want the video to reveal who you are and your relationships with your students. For my preparation of my 30-minute video, I took six hours of taping that was edited down. A key is to show your teaching style in a variety of settings. However, a single lesson has been used. Be real. The video will be submitted by the middle of January. The judges have their work cut out as they will choose three finalists. What an honor to be one of the three finalists. A panel of three judges will come to the three finalist school in early February. They will observe you teach and interact with your students. You will submit a schedule for your day full of observations, interviews, and interactions. What a day it will be for you and your school. A suggestion to make a more lasting impression is to prepare activities or lessons to reveal your teaching in a variety of ways. It is a time for you to showcase your teaching style. Is it exciting to show these three individuals your teaching passion? I prepared by having support letters from students, parents, colleagues, and administration to be viewed by the panel. You will need individuals to be ready to be interviewed by the panel from the group of individuals that I have mentioned to write support letters. I had a table of my teaching accomplishments awards and publications ready for the panel to, of judges to look at. Being one of the three finalists, you will receive an expense paid trip to the National Science Teachers Association Conference. In early March, you will be notified of your standing. If you are the winner, besides the trip, you will receive a $10,000 reward. That's right, you will receive the $10,000 for your passion for teaching science to your students at the awards gala. The process is rewarding in itself. I have grown professionally this past year as I went through the process of applying for the Shell National Science Teaching Award. The individuals I have met so far have been amazing. Individuals that share the same passion about science as I have have challenged me to continue on. I am so grateful for the National Science Teachers Association and thankful for the Shell Oil Company partnering with NSTA. I am humbled and at the same time recharged after 40 years of teaching to continue to challenge individuals to continue on the way to finding truth and discovering life. I want to encourage you to press on this year. Complete the application. You will be glad that you did.